hello friends in this video lecture i am going to discuss about special cases in roots hurwitz criteria to find out the stability of control system let us see one example determine stability by roots criteria the given characteristic equation is s to the power 5 plus s to the power 4 plus 2s cube plus 2s square plus 3s plus 5 is equal to 0 this is the given example for this we have to find out the stability whether the system is stable or unstable so, uh, this is the characteristic equation having fifth order so first of all draw roots array so s to the power 5 s to the power 4 s to the power 3 s to the power 2 s to the power 1 s to the power 0 the coefficient of s5 is 1 skip one term and coefficient of s cube is 2 skip one term again next is 3 coefficient of s4 is 1 skip one term 2 skip one term 5 now here we have to solve the determinant 1 into 2 minus 1 into 2 divided by 1 so we get answer 0 1 into 3 minus 1 into 5 here we get minus 2 here 0 again 0 into 2 is 0 minus 1 into minus 2 divided by 0 at the denominator we get 0 so answer is infinity so here we get the infinity so we need to find out the what is the sign positive or negative so we are replacing this zero because of that we get the infinity by some constant say epsilon the value of epsilon is very very small If you solve this, we get 2 epsilon plus 2 divided by epsilon. Phi epsilon minus 0 divided by epsilon is phi. Then proceed for next row. If you solve this, we get minus 4 epsilon minus 4 minus 5 minus 5 epsilon square divided by twice epsilon plus 2 so it's 0 again find for the last row here you get 5 now to find out the signs in the first column put limit in the first column limit epsilon tends to 0 the first term limit epsilon tends to 0 for this term 
I'm substituting the limit twice epsilon plus 2 divided by epsilon after putting limit you get 2 plus infinity so your sign is positive 2 plus infinity is positive on next term limit epsilon tends to 0 for this term no substitute limit if you substitute limit you get minus 4 by 2 that is minus 2 now we have to put this value in first column now rewrite the first column of root array that is 1 as it is then 1 as it is here epsilon your value of 2 by epsilon plus 2 by infinity is positive value the value of this is minus 2 here 5 as it is now if you look at the first column of the root array here one time sign change here second time sign change so here two times sign change so interpretation from the root array is first time second time two times sign change means two times sign changes Two roots or poles are present in the right hand plane of the S plane. The system is unstable. This is the special case for the root Hurwitz criteria to find out the stability. Let us proceed for next special case for the root Hurwitz criteria. So let us see one example by root criteria determine stability of system. The given characteristic equation is s to the power 6 plus s to the power 5 plus 8 s to the power 4 12 s to the power cube 20 s square 16 s plus 16 is equal to 0. So, for this characteristic equation, now for this equation, find out stability whether system is stable or unstable so first plot the root array to the power 6 coefficient is 1 8 now we have 20 and 16 coefficient is 2 12 16 0 Solve this matrix now. Here to get answer to
if you solve this 2 into 20 minus 16 into 1 divided by 2 we will get answer 1 2 12 that is if you solve this you get answer 16 is 0 now again proceed for the next row solve this matrix here you get 0 now if you look at the second row and third row all elements are the same so obviously fourth row is coming 0 so here all elements of the fourth row are 0 now in this case we have to pick one auxiliary equation from the row above of zero row this is called as the auxiliary polynomial equation let us see select auxiliary polynomial equation from row above the zero row is third row that row above zero row so the equation is a of s is equal to twice s to the power 4 plus 12 s to the power 2 plus 16 is equal to 0 now differentiate this auxiliary equation with respect to s You will get 8 to the power 3 plus 24s. Now replace 0 row by this equation. So here s to the power 3 is 8 and s is 24. Now again follow the same rule 8 into 12 minus 24 into 2 divided by 8. If you solve this, you get answer is equal to 6. Again 8 into 16 minus 2 into 0 divided by 8. You will get answer 16 when we solve this matrix you will get answer 2.67 here you get 0 here you get 16 now from the first column of the roots array interpretation is no sign changes in first column so no roots present in right hand side plane of S plane
so system is stable thank you for watching this video let us try to solve more numerical by rule service criteria to find out the stability of system